everybody, this is Doll Dazzler and welcome to my channel. I've been making some videos on ideas you can use when building settlements in Fallout 4. And in today's video, I'm at Kingport's Lighthouse. At the front of the settlement, I again use those same prefab, uh, steel prefabs, the in and outdoors as I call them. Nothing too special about these yet. I will be coming back to update this settlement. I have come back a few times, but um, this settlement has gotten quite large. So in order to continue to build, I do need to remove some of this uh, heavier uh, concrete. Uh, but I will be doing the updating and uh, doing another video. This is just the perimeter of the front side of this settlement. Um, it does not go all the way around. I do have um, a little bit of a walkway that goes around where the water is, but I mostly get attacked from this side. So um, this is a good way to be able to escape and also help defend the settlement. I had built the stores and the main house for the settlers around and on that house that was the pre-existing house here with uh, at this settlement um, the main house is the stores and then off to the side is the um, the main house for the settlers uh, over here is the uh, mutt fruit and my beacon and this walkway just goes to the back and nothing interesting on this side so I'll take you through on the other side and this is just the back side where the stores are, so I'll take you um, and show you the stores from the other side as well. So coming over here, I'm going to go down to the water area first, the marina type of area. I kept all of this intact and I just added uh, the concrete around uh, the walkway. Um, I did like the walkway. It, this actually got large really, really quickly because this was the first area where I started to build because I wanted to do the water purifiers first. So those are my Brahmin feeders. So I kept this walkway intact and I can get down here and that's just the, so that I can come down and fix the water purifiers if I need to. Nothing too special down there. And then off to the middle here, I do want to still do something with this little house here, maybe a little uh, a little boat house or something of that nature. If you guys have any um, suggestions for me, please leave it in the comments. If I use your suggestion, I will most definitely give you the credit in the updated video. So that's about it for down here. So going on up into the store area. Oh, over here, the lighthouse I haven't done anything with. I kind of left it uh, just, um, just blank. Um, at the very, very top, I do want to do something to create the lighting in the, uh, the very top of the lighthouse. Other than that, I'll probably just leave it the way that it is. And that's the workshop. So in this area here are the stores. And the stores are completed, I just need to give them their names, put their, uh, put their signs up for what I'm going to name them. And again, if you guys have any uh, cool, quirky ideas uh, for me, please leave it in the comments. And then going on up is another store up here. And then I do have a little bathroom over to the back side. So those need uh, just a couple little things and to be named. And then on the back side here is where the main house is for the settlers. So back going this way is a bedroom and I'll take you over here first. So this is a kitchen and the dining room. And coming out here is it's like halfway up the lighthouse. It's really cool. It's kind of like a little uh, patio type area. I um, kind of want to do like a little barbecue. I'm not quite finished with the look out here. So I was thinking like a little barbecuing area, a little um, area where there's some seating. And then coming back in and going this direction. I have two bedrooms in the settlement um, because I do have quite a bit of settlers, but these bedrooms are a little bit narrow. So I had to make two of them. And then there's the second one. 
and then um, coming back over here I'll go take you up here first before I go into the bathroom this is the top of the uh, settlement so this is a really good area to uh, help defend the settlement um, coming off this way this is where I did add some stairs in here so that I can get back up because it's kind of a it's kind of a, of a drop there to get to this area over here I'll just go down there this is the best place to fight because um, you do have a little bit of cover from this tree it's a pretty good area to fight uh, or to defend the settlement and then you can just take this uh, back up to the top so yeah up there I do I want to add some lights into the actual top of the lighthouse so um, I'm kind of excited if you guys have any ideas on what works best out of the lights uh, to light up the lighthouse area or the uh, light area of the lighthouse um, please leave it in the comments um, it's gonna have to be either a lot of lights or something very very bright so um, I know that originally there was the um, the glowing guy up there and I kind of wanted to keep him up there but um, you have to keep defending it and so when he dies then it's not bright anymore so if you guys have any cool ideas for me in order to light that up real bright please leave it in the comments and then the last thing I will show you at this settlement is the bathroom this bathroom is really large <laughs> and overly done I had stacked the pictures in this settlement I stacked the pictures in here uh, over the top of the uh, the uh, unframed pictures to create the wallpaper effect and then in here I use the frame pictures and the frame pictures they they look really cool but again they add to the size of the settlement and then these actually they stack out pretty thick on top of each other so keep that in mind if you're use, utilizing that idea um, that it can kind of affect uh, a walkway if you're using a, uh, a thi uh, pictures in a thin walkway or a, or a narrow walkway that it does add to the um, to the depth of that walkway it can make it a little bit difficult and then this is just the tub area I'm almost finished with this look I need to cover up the tub a little bit but um, for the most part this is complete and then in here is just the toilet so I utilized that uh, the picture idea through the whole thing and this I did create this settlement um, well long before I found out about the the mirrors so I may come back and see if I can take out these uh, pictures and do the mirrors um, because I really would like to have a mirror I would like to have mirrors in here I think over here I was gonna do like a little vanity so I'm not quite done with that so maybe I can uh, remove these pictures and try to do a mirror here so anyway this is Kingport's lighthouse if you guys like this video please like and subscribe if you have any good ideas for me or suggestions for that little house down there by the water or the lights in the lighthouse, please, um, please leave it in the comments for me. And I will most definitely give you the credit in my updated video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.